Hi there. Welcome to my Facebook Live today. And I'll be sharing some techniques from energy medicine yoga and energy medicine. So I'll just, while people are coming to join me here on live, see someone has joined. So welcome. And if you're watching this at a later date, um, enjoy it and may it benefit you for many moons to come. Uh, so what we'll be working with, hi Wan Zhang, um, are techniques for getting your energy moving forward and crossing over, which are optimal for our health. And so we'll do that with the energy medicine yoga wake up. And then we'll also work with a something which is referred to as the crown pull and spinal flush to help break up any patterns of headaches and also little detox with some neurolymphatic reflex points. And uh, we'll work with something which is referred to as the Brazilian toe technique. And that's to help to, um, to bring forth deep relaxation. And it's really a great technique to utilize for going to sleep. So I know I'm teaching it at two o'clock in the afternoon. Um, but that will help you with deep relaxation and it might even help you tonight when you go to sleep or you can just repeat it tonight when you're going to sleep. So again, these are coming from energy medicine yoga techniques, which were developed by uh, Lauren Walker and Donna Eden is the energy medicine guru. So um, you can look those two people up and they have beautiful books for reference and I also teach at yogasynthesis.com I teach energy medicine yoga classes which happen on um, Monday evening tonight at 7 also tomorrow morning at 8 o'clock in the morning and then Saturday at 7 in the morning um, and then let's see Oh, and I'm also offering a workshop this weekend or this Friday from 5.30 till 8.30 uh, Eastern time. And it's on emotional balancing. So energy medicine, yoga, and emotional balancing. So, okay, enough of the commercial. So we'll get started. So come to, you can be in a, I'm sitting. So eventually you're gonna be sitting um, because that Brazilian toe technique needs to be done seated, but everything else can be done standing. So if you choose to be standing, feel free to do so. So let's just come to, um, let's come to quiet for a moment. Close the eyes, let the spine grow nice and long. Connect to your natural breath. Connect to your inner space and ask yourself the question, how do I feel? Whatever pops up, bubbles up, just let it be acknowledged and just take note of how you feel physically, mentally, emotionally, spiritually. Great. So now we'll come to the energy medicine yoga wake up. Fingertips together, find your clavicles. Drop down on either side of your sternum. Your sternum is breastbone. So either side underneath those collarbones. Begin to thump there. Inhale through the nose, exhale out of the mouth. Releasing any excess energy. This is the on switch for all of those subtle energy systems. Drop one hand, come right in the center of the sternum, awakening that immune system. Inhale through the nose, exhale out of the mouth. Both hands on your side body. Tapping on those side ribs, shoulder blades towards each other, reach through the crown. Open up through the heart, exhale out of the mouth, releasing and helping to process all that is coming through your system today and yesterday and the months. Ah, helping the spleen process things. 
two fingers underneath the eyes on the cheekbones. Inhale through the nose, exhale out of the mouth, helping to ground. Maybe come, become aware of your tailbone, anchor to the earth. Maybe offer gratitude to the earth and affection. This beautiful relation. Greeting her with affection. Let your hands rest on your, at your side or on your lap, witnessing your inner space. Connect to an intention for this practice, for this day, maybe just one word, love, gratitude, peace, whatever it is, whatever bubbles up, connect to that. Connect to its essence. And breathe that in and breathe it out. Opening the eyes, reach the right arm up, right hand down. Left arm up, left hand down. It might be opposite to you, but just reach. Same side. And let's cross over. We'll shake that off. Crossing over. So if you're lifting your knees, marching in place, cross crawling. Moving at the navel, twisting, opening up through the trunk. That lower back right behind the navel. Circling through your arm, just crossing your energy over. Inhale through the nose, exhale out of the mouth. Great, shake that off. Let's just come to sweeping across from one shoulder to the opposite hip. And just reinforcing that crossing over pattern. So you could do this if you're driving, making sure you're holding on with one hand, not so fast. <clears throat> or just sitting and you feel like, Okay, my brain is shut off a little bit. It's a little wonky. I've been in front of the computer a little bit too much, and you can just sweep across. Shake that off. Great. Hands in front of the pubic bone. Return to your intention. Connect with the, in, the essence. And let's zip that up to the mouth. Flip the hands. Spread that out into the auric field. Two more times. So it's an inhale through the nose. Exhale out of the mouth. One more time. One finger into the navel, one finger between the brow. Push in, pull up, and just locking that energy in, hooking that energy. Exhale out of the mouth. Great. Shake that off. So that crown pull spinal flush for helping to break up headaches, fingertips, pads, right in the middle of the forehead. Press in and then just rake your fingers over your forehead to your temples and give a little buzz there. Let's do that one more time. Press in and pull across. And we'll do this all the way around the crown, meeting in the middle. Press in and press in and pull apart. Press in and pull apart. Press in and pull apart, making your way all the way down to the back of your head until you come to the base of your skull. Press in, pull apart. Press in, pull apart. Press in, pull apart. Scrub along the occipital ridge, so right at the ridge. Great. Terrific. Let's shake that off. I forgot a step which is really important, scrubbing, just pressing in to the top of the skull. Any tender spots, spend a little bit of time there. Ah, you might find that there's a balancing spot on the other side, maybe not, but just press in, circle into those places. So you're just releasing any tension in the scalp. Exhaling out of the mouth, releasing that excess energy. Okay, shake that off. We'll come back 
to the forehead. Press in, pull apart, come all the way to the temples. And as we go around the whole crown, we just press in and pull apart about an inch and make your way all the way down. So press in with the pads and it might feel tender, it might hurt a little bit, that's okay. Just press in and pull. You're breaking up the, this pattern of tightness across the middle, that suture of the cranium. And then make your way back to the occipital ridge and scrub there. Terrific. Make your way back to the spine and then press your fingers on either side of the spine, press in and pull away. Press in, pull away, making your way down the back of your neck until you come to your shoulders. And then you'll come to the tops of your shoulders and squeeze three times. Releasing. Rake those fingers over the shoulders. Come in between each rib with your fingers underneath your clavicle. Press in on either side of your sternum and pull away. So we're working on neurolymphatic reflex points here too. Press in, pull away. Press in, pull away. Make your way all the way down between your breasts and your pecs until you can come underneath and find your spine. <laughs> so, on either side of your spine, press in, pull away. And you might find that it feels tender. Just spend a little bit more time there. Press in, pull away. Press in, pull away. And then scrub all the way out to your hips. Scrub onto your sacrum and sweep off. Shake that off. Let's do the back, the, the spinal flush again. So press in on either side and pull away. Press in, pull away, press in, pull away, come to the tops of the shoulders, squeeze three times, come over the shoulders, come to the sides of the sternum, press in all the way down, underneath, and then scrub on either side. So as you can see, to break up this pattern, you can just keep on repeating this technique until the energy starts to release. Scrub all the way out to the sides of the hips and then onto the sacrum and sweep that off. Ah, feels so good. Shake that off. <clears throat> okay, great. So now, so Wan Zhang and Carolyn, you're my, um, my star pupils. <laughs> so, um, so this Brazilian toe hold or toe technique. So you can do it um, in half lotus like so, um, or one way that is probably most accessible is in Baddha Konasana. <clears throat> and so what we'll do is work with the toes and the fingers. So, whatever is most comfortable for you, um, whatever position. I'm gonna work with the thumbs on the, the bottoms of the toes and the fingers will be on the nail side of the toes. So we'll start with the, the middle finger and the middle toe. So we'll take the middle finger and place it on the nail of the middle toe and the thumb on the, the pad of the toe. And so we'll work with this just a minute for each toe. But ideally you want to work two to three minutes, maybe even five minutes, but I think that's a little bit too much. Two to three. And just let yourself settle here and breathe here. So like I said before, it's really a deep relaxation technique. It's also great for helping you to sleep. And it's also detoxifying. So let yourself soften into your body. Let your breath be natural.
So now we'll move to the next toe, which is the fourth toe or the, the one next to the pinky toe or baby toe or little toe, whatever. Move your thumb to the pad of that toe and then your ring finger comes to the nail. So that's your fourth finger on your fourth toe. And again, just a minute there. Witnessing inwardly, and maybe even just breathing with your intention, with the essence of that intention. So the next toe we'll be going to is the little toe, or the pinky toe. So bringing your thumb to that pad and then your pinky to that nail bed or to that nail. And just with a gentle touch, just settling in there, softening, quieting. So next we'll be moving to the second toe. So the toe that's next to your big toe. So ideally keeping your pinkies on your nail bed and then moving your thumb to the second toe, to the pad of that finger, or that, excuse me, the pad of that toe, and then taking your index finger onto the nail. And we'll spend a minute here. Again, softening, connecting to your mantra, your intention, the essence of that word. move to the big toe. So then the thumb goes to the pad of the big toe and then your middle and index fingers. So these two fingers come to the big toe now. And we'll stay there. Softening, settling, just witnessing. Witnessing the quieting, the balancing. Great, so that's the Brazilian toe technique and it's really great for assisting sleep. So, and I know that we only did one minute for each toe. What's recommended is two to three minutes. So I bow to you, I bow to your heart and I offer you peace, love, health, and happiness. Have a really beautiful day. So again, if you want to learn any more energy medicine yoga techniques, I share them in classes at yogasynthesis.com, live streaming, and I'm offering a, an emotional um, energy medicine yoga for emotional balance this 
Friday from 5.30 to 8.30. It's lecture and practice. Okay, have a great day. Thanks for joining me.